Hello everyone, this is the Magic Master, and welcome back to Across the Time. This is episode 9 of this adventure slash RPG map. If you want to check it out, the link is- if you want to check out the map, the link is in the description. In the last episode, we helped this guy clear out the spiders from his cellar and retrieved a bottle, as well as helped our dog finally grow even bigger. We've now got seven, I believe. Let's just count again. We've got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Yep. Um, and today, we're going to head off into the desert of Kakara, um, and try and find the gem that we're looking for. Although, he did say his daughter, daughter found something in the cave where she walked, a short walk from here. Worked a short walk from here, which would be great, except we've got the daughter's book, and it doesn't actually say where the, uh, thing is. Almost completely flooded, like it says, she works in the mine, but we don't know where the mine is. A strange wall in the cave, like, so there's got to be something in that cave, and it's something we should check out at some point. But right now, we just don't know how. We're gonna let one zombie in at a time, just so we can easily- Whoa! Dogs! The dogs all stood themselves up, just to defend me. I said I'll let one zombie in at a time, and then I accidentally opened the door to all of them at once. We're in big trouble, folks. Close the door, close the door! I didn't expect there to be that many zombies outside that door. I expected there to be a couple, sure. A couple I could deal with. This is not a couple. This is a lot. This is a swarm. Oh my god. Oh my god. No! Okay. Um, hopefully my dogs are okay. They're miles away now, but hopefully they're okay. Gotta be honest, not the start to the video I'd hoped for. Right, what does this axe actually do? It's a legendary axe. It has sharpness 1. How much damage does it deal? Plus 4.25. Okay, this is a better weapon. And is it unbreakable? It's not unbreakable though, so we're gonna have to keep an eye on that. But I should be using it instead of the thing because it's stronger. Okay, let's rush back to that house, help out the dogs. Not how I intended to start the day, but oh well. On the bright side, we've got uh, 169 things now. We're making mo we're making money. I'm not sure how we're making money because I still don't understand the system, but we are. Oh, also I've got books. I always forget I have books. Okay, I need to keep my I put my spells in my hotbar, because they could be useful. Okay, we've got Inferno and Fireball. Those could come in handy. Okay, let's head up this bridge, and if we get swarmed by zombies again, we're going to cast Inferno, and that'll hopefully take them out. Keyword, admittedly, is hopefully, and there's a slight chance it'll also light my dogs on fire, which would be very, very bad. But hopefully, hopefully, there's that word again, hopefully everything will go according to plan, and we'll be fine. We shall see. Run, 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 run. That was almost a song. Run, run. Run, run. I don't know. I'm inventing songs now. Remember when we used to do song of the day? I say used to. We're still going to do it. I just, for the past, what, like three months now? Just for this series, which is eight episodes. Nine episodes? So two months and a bit. I think, two and a bit months? I don't know. I don't know how long this has been running for at this point. See, the desert of Kakara is this way. The cave- oh, is this the cave where the daughter worked? Maybe? Okay, wait, there's the house. Uh, do I still have rotten flesh to feed the dogs? I do. So hopefully they're all okay. Okay, one, two, three, four, five, six. Uh oh, I only count six. Oh no, wait, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Okay, we're good. We've got all of them. They're all okay. We're fine. That was. That was some things, but that was. That was unexpected. Okay. Now that we've done that, we're gonna head out into the desert of Kakaraya. 
Now that we've proven we are woefully unprepared, I guess we can head out. Because there's nothing else down there. What I want to do is find this cave where the daughter worked. I don't know where it would be. Oh, what have I done? Why have I walked outside in the middle of that thing? Am I gonna track the zombie army again if I stand out here? Why are you standing up? Oh, you're not mine. That's why. Okay, we're hiding. We're hiding inside till the daylight. We're hiding inside till daylight. Is there any food in this place? Um, no. Not ideal, actually. Oh, we got some coal though. Potato. Okay, let's make a baked potato. Because we can. We've got some coal on a potato, so we might as well. So that we've at least eaten something. How's our armor doing, by the way? I haven't checked in a while. Oh, we've lost our helmet. Luckily, we've got thousands of those. Throw that on. We're good to go. Eat this baked potato. Doesn't do much, but it does a little. Hello, doggies of all shapes and sizes. Uh, do any of these need fed? You should be sat down, mister. Do you need fed, though? No, you're good. Do you want any fed? No, you do not. I'm going around feeding them to make sure they're, like, not low on health. The unintended side effect of doing that is we end up with a whole bunch of new dogs. Who then spawn low on health, and therefore eat all the extra rotten flesh anyway. Hi, buddy. There we go. You're all happy now. You can sit down. You can sit down. Did we make another baby dog, or did we, did we not make another baby dog? Maybe we didn't make another baby dog. Maybe I imagined it. Oh, you're still standing up. Oh, and you're still standing up. We did make another baby dog. Okay, um, there's zombies at our door again. We've got nine dogs now. Same, same amount of dogs as there are episodes of this series. This, wow. So that kind of video plans just constantly fall apart. Okay, we're gonna try this part again. Oh, there's only one at the door this time. Okay, we're good. We're good, we're good. It's dead. Whoa, why are you standing up? What part of sit down did you guys not understand? I was wrong. I was very wrong when I said there was only one left. Okay, no, wait, there's three here. I can fight three, right? Oh, unless the axe breaks on me and then we're back to using the unbreakable sword. Okay. There we go. Let's push these all back inside where it's safer. Go on, in you go. You too, buddy. This way. This, this poor guy who lives here, he thought we were just going to help him out. Instead, we've just turned his house into a <laughs> dog-sitting place. Okay, dogs are all safely inside. Desert is that way. Cave is where? What's down here? Well, we've already been to the forest of Phyron. This way is North Plain. Is that where they worked? Whoa. I feel like that's probably not where they worked, because I feel like that's probably where I said that, and then I immediately saw the cave, so I take that back. We're going to head down that cave and see if we can find whatever secrets were here. Oh no, that's just a bridge. Whoa, and, arm and weapons, we are nowhere near ready to fight yet, so let's back off. Clearly we shouldn't be going this way yet. We are not ready for it. I feel I feel like I really want to take my dogs with me. Okay, we're gonna eat this rotten flesh because I'm starving and I don't have a choice. It's probably going to poison me. There it goes. But I think as long as we stand still for 27 seconds, we should be fine. Of course, if someone comes to attack us in those 27 seconds, that would be really, really inconvenient.
Ah, and food. Food poisoning's gone. We are good to go. Let's let's keep running, shall we? Okay, so we still don't know where that cave is, but we're not going down the north lane yet. So back to Desert of Hakara, I guess. Cause yeah, that's the forest down there. We've already been there. The desert is the way to go. Cause I don't know where that cave is. Um maybe we'll find it one day, maybe we won't. There's no way to tell. Okay. Every dog I see, I'm like, I've got bones, I want to tame them. But we're just going to end up with endless dogs. Maybe that's a good thing. I don't think there's going to be any dogs in this desert anyway. So next time we see a dog, we will try and tame it. Because surely nine bones will be enough. Actually, now that we're uh, going to where skeletons are anyway, it should be even easier to get bones than before. And I see a giant... No, that's the pirate ship, right? Is the pirate ship where we're meant to be going? Because we were told it was in the desert, but other than that, I don't think we were told specifically where it was. Whoa. That was like on cue. Strike a thunder. Skeleton appears with a much stronger sword, I might add. Did he drop it? He didn't. He did drop some nice boots, though. Which I will gladly take. Did he drop any food? No, that would be too much to ask. There's some water there. Not that water is as rare as variable as you think it is. Variable? Rare? Valuable? Rare? I don't know what I was trying to say there. As you think it would be in the middle of the desert, but you know, always good to know. Oh, there is civilization there. You know if anything starts, if a creeper starts chasing me, I can't sprint, so I'm just walking away. You ever tried outrunning a creeper while walking? Oh, this music just got creepy all of a sudden. I don't think I like it very much. I mean, I do like it, it's just creepy. Hi, creeper. Oh shoot, you're smarter than I thought you were. Normally you could just let it blow away, blow up and then run away, but the problem is I can't run away because I don't have the speed for it. Okay, we've done it, we've killed it. We're good. This music is every bit as loud as I thought it was going to be, and by that I mean it's far too loud. I have to eat rotten flesh again. Immediately get food poisoning from it, but we power through. We're still just gonna walk, but that should help us regenerate. Hey, achievement unlocked. We've killed 50 monsters. Whoa, and now we're being chased by two evil skeletons. Who are wicked fast, by the way. Why are they so fast? Oh, and I died. And I think that's gonna put us back at the spawn of the city. Oh, God. Okay. This episode, we make very little progress, apparently. Maybe I shouldn't run the whole way there. Like, it's really tempting to, but I'm just- okay, we're gonna- We're gonna stop off at the grocer again and buy a bunch more food. And by a bunch more food, I mean however much food we can afford. Because not having food is kind of a problem when you're playing Minecraft. Where is the grocer? Is it this one? No, this is the adventurer. He's like the one room I can't use. Ah, it's here. The grocer. There we go. Um... And sure enough, here it is. We're gonna buy a couple of steaks. And then some bread. And I think that'll do us. That was like a hundred chronotons or whatever the money thing is called. Uh, oh, I need to organize everything again. Okay, we need our sword. And then we need our food. And then we're going to put our spells here. 
Uh, I'm going to put our things on. This helmet's about to break, and I can't really bother to keep it, so we're just going to throw it away and grab this new one. That'll clear up some inventory space. Good to go. Okay. Now we can head upstairs and out. Now that we've got some food again, we can start running. And yeah, head into the desert. Do you like how the plan this whole episode has been head into the desert? We are 15 minutes through the episode and we are yet to really head into the desert. Well, we made it in, we just didn't make it back out. We could bring our dogs. The thing is, if we bring the dogs, I feel like they're going to die. I really don't want them to die. So I feel like we're just going to have to make an endless army of dogs. And then once we have an endless amount, we can just bring some with us every now and again. Not all of them, because we want to keep dogs. But a couple can come adventuring with us, just the bravest and the toughest, you know? Because <laughs> at this point, the series very temporarily became, let the dogs kill everything while you watch. <laughs> in the background, which doesn't feel like it's in the spirit of the game. So, we try again. We carry on forth. So, do we know what Jack- I should have went back and talked to the king, because he would have told me exactly what we were looking for. So if I die again, we're gonna have- we're gonna have to talk to the king quickly. Just so we can figure out what exactly it is we're going after, because I know we're going to the desert of Kakara. I remember that. But after that, I don't actually remember what we're meant to be doing. Which, you know, I feel like would be quite useful information to have. Uh, I should also be looking down this side, I guess, to see if I see a cave anywhere. Because that's another thing. Should we? Let, let's tame this dog, shall we? Hello. Oh, that took only one bone. Welcome to the team, doggy. You can come with us in the desert. You are the chosen one. I will do my very best to keep you alive. Okay, having food again is really good. Glad I bought that. That is a skeleton. That is a pirate. I feel like there's got to be someone on the pirate ship, right? I'm not sure if the pirate ship is where we're meant to be going. Oh, no. That'll be where we're meant to be going. That desert temple. So then we'll check out the pirate ship afterwards, because you better believe we're checking out that pirate ship. But, let's check out that desert temple first. Because if I had to guess, I would say that's where we're meant to be. This thunder gets really annoying. However, the question is, how do I get up there? I haven't lost my dog already, have I? No, there he is. Another pool of water. I can hear the skeleton. I can see the creeper. I'm pretty sure dogs are scared of creepers, and then ocelots scare them. Scare creepers, I mean, not dogs. Okay, if we climb up here... Just, let's just trace around the outline of the sand for a minute, shall we? See what we can find. Oops. Ooh, a desert village of some sort. See? Told you it'd be worth the trip. We didn't actually get where we went, wanted to go, but we did get somewhere new. So let's go on over there and see what's happening, shall we? That's a sign that I don't want blown up. Since I have absolutely no idea if... What's it called is on? If, uh... Terrain damage or whatever is on? This is Oasis de Sirocco. Is this where we're meant to go for the gem? Probably not, it looks a bit too calm for that, but maybe. Hello! Kane Deckard. Stay a while and listen. You seem pretty determined, noble stranger. If you haven't been caught by time yet, I have a task for you. Could you help me put find some ink on the squids in the village pond? Twenty would be enough. I would love to finish my memoirs before losing my head in this heat. I would reward you. Uh, no problem. Great. When you shall have twenty, leave them in the container. Okay. So, we've once again changed our plan for the Desert of Kakara. Instead of trying to find the next gem, like we probably should be doing, we're going to go and find 20 ink. 20 ink sacks to help this guy write his memoirs, apparently. So that's what we're going to be doing next week, because unfortunately that is all the time we have in this video. Thank you all very much for watching, and I will see you all next time. Bye team challenge!